Welcome to Celebrating Act Two. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life. The first tip is track it. You've got to know when and where your puppy's going. So I would recommend that you get a piece of paper or a note on your phone somewhere, someplace, make sure that you are writing down when your puppy goes, where they go, and what time it was. And as well as any specific signs that your puppy may have shown or given you to let you know that they indeed had to go. The second tip is reward it. You wanna make sure that you are being clear with your puppy on where it works. What works to get that potty happening, make it a potty party outside every time your puppy does something well when it comes to the potty department. Pee and poops should get rewarded every time in the moment right after they go potty. Yep. Good puppy, what a good puppy, yay! Good puppy! Good boy! The third tip is you want to make sure that you're managing it. What does that mean? What does that look like? Managing and prevention is key. That means you want to make sure that you have baby gates in your main area so that your puppy can't run to another part of the house and freely potty in a place that you don't want him to. Because let's face it, every time your puppy gets to practice, peeing or pooping where you don't want it, it's working. It's reinforcement. And you want to be on top of managing the environment the best that you can while rewarding your puppy to go potty in the place that you want him to go. Because that's how you move behavior that you want up and up on his list of things to do. As soon as it's time to go potty, you want to quickly Allow your dog to come out of their safe place and follow them immediately outside and be ready to reward them. Let's go. Good job. So again, the top three tips are track it. Make sure you know when and where your puppy is going potty. Keep track of it. Keep a log on your fridge or on your phone so that you know what you need to do to change your pattern behaviors to keep your puppy successful. Number two is reward it, always pay out. You are in the process of building a new skill for your puppy and you need to make sure you're giving clarity as to what does work. Make sure that you refrain from reprimanding your puppy when they have an accident, because that's on you. Number three is manage it. You wanna make sure that you have a safe place for your puppy to retreat to when they haven't gone potty so that they can't wander away and go potty in another place of the house. So baby gates, exercise pens, and crates, all utilized as positive places are really important for management and prevention during the potty training process. Let's go. Good job. I hope you found these tips to be helpful. We'll see you on the next video. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life.